हेलो स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स ड्रॉ दी फर्स्ट रे डायग्राम फॉर अ कॉन्केव मिरर ओके सो हाउ टू ड्रॉ इट सो जस्ट कीप यूर प्रोट्रेक्टर हियर यू कैन इवन यूज कंपास टू ड्रॉ द कॉन्केव मिरर ओके बट आई विल टेल यू हाउ यू कैन ड्रॉ कॉन्केव मिरर यूजिंग प्रोट्रेक्टर सो दिस इज द नाइंटी डिग्री लाइन ओके दिस वन सो यू टेक थर्टी डिग्री ऑन टॉप ओके फॉर एग्जाम्पल सिक्सटी हियर सो फ्रॉम हियर टू हियर थर्टी डिग्री टेन ट्वेंटी थर्टी एंड थर्टी डिग्री डाउन टेन ट्वेंटी थर्टी ओके you just draw an arc like this okay so this is your concave mirror and this point is called the pole of the mirror it is p okay and just shade the back side of the mirror this is the non reflecting side of the mirror so mn okay so this is this is the aperture mn is so if you draw a straight line from here this is the aperture okay now what you do you draw the principal axis okay let's draw the principal axis and then mark the focus and center of curvature so what you can do from pole you can take say 3 cm okay you take 3 cm here so this is the focus f okay and then from f you take another 3 cm okay so it is the center of curvature is center of curvature and this is focus so what is most important thing here is pf distance and fc distance should be the same f is the midpoint of this cp you could have taken it 2 cm and 2 cm not a problem so i have taken 3 and 3 okay now so the first uh, in the first figure the object is placed at infinity so let's draw the object here at infinity okay so here is the object so this is a this is b so this arrow head is important this is the head of head of the uh, object okay uh, and this is the tail you can imagine it in that way okay now to draw the ray diagram so why do we draw ray diagram just to know where is the image formed what whether it is small whether it is big whether it is of the same size as of the object and all okay so this we uh, this we find out using ray diagrams so what we'll do is we just need two rays okay to know where the image is formed so let's draw any two rays okay so uh, i'll start from here so the the object is at infinity infinity means it's very very far from this concave mirror okay so let me draw the first ray that is parallel to the principal axis okay so this ray is parallel to the principal axis okay so this arrow is very important so this is the incident ray that means from this object which is at infinity this ray is coming and hitting the reflecting surface okay now this is the incident ray this is the incident ray it is parallel to the principal axis so a ray parallel to the principal axis after reflection from where it passes